Maxima and welcome to part one of Stardew Valley um, so I had to turn the music off because of copyright sorry but anyways welcome to part one of Stardew Valley wait I wonder if you can I'm gonna have the music on if I get copyrighted then I'll know for next time not to have it on I'm gonna lower this down a bit more in case it's too loud. Put on one. Sorry guys, I was fixing um the um audio in case it's too loud and you can't hear me. Cause that happened last time. Okay. Let's put that on one. That down a bit. Okay, that should do it. So let's go to name Hannah. Mom, piss magic. Favorite thing, sleeping. <laughs> we want a dog. We want this hairstyle. I'm gonna try and make hair out of my comfort zone. Like, I'm gonna give her a purple hair color. I want her to have blue eyes. Because I have blue eyes. I wanted to have pit hair color. That's blue. I want it to be a bit lighter. And I'm gonna give her a punky shit. I like the one with a heart on it. If I can find it. Oh, I went past it. Whoops. Okay, and I want them to block. Okay, let's get into the game five. Okay. Oh, hi. I'm for my special granddaughter. I'm thinking that's me. Just so this is not lasting, sorry. I'm pulling it down a bit more. So you can hear my voice instead of the music. Sorry guys, I was just checking. I want you to have the sealed envelope. Thank you. No, no, don't open it yet. Have patience. Now listen close. There will come a day when you feel crushed by the burden of modern life. Meaning now. Okay. <laughs> and your bright spirit will fade before a growing emptiness. When that happens, my dear, you'll be ready for this gift. The gift of life. Just kidding. Now let Grandpa rest. XX years later. I don't even know what XX means. It's probably three or two. Who knows? Oh, we're in a crappy workplace. That looks like egg computers. Oh, never mind. Terminated. Oh, got a cowboy licking his lips. He had too much coke, probably. Then we have a blonde chick just staring at a black screen and a dead skeleton. Great, great workplace. Life is better with Joja. But you've got a dead person at the end of the terminals. No one realizes that, or. Oh, hello. Dear honey, if you are reading this, you must be in dire need of a change. If you've seen that weird place, you'll be in a dire need of a change too. The same thing happened to me long ago. I lost sight of what mattered the most in life real connections with other people and nature. Oh. <laughs> So I dropped everything and moved to the place I truly belonged. I've closed the deed to the place that my pride and joy, Prismatic Farm. It's located in Stardew Valley on the Sound Coast. It's the perfect place to start your new life. This way, my, this is my pre most precious gift of all, and now it's yours. I know you'll honor the family name, my dear. Good luck. Okay. 
Love Grandpa. P.S. If Lewis is still alive, say hi to the old guy for me, will ya? Okay. So I'm guessing we're moving to the farm. So I've got a few things I want to explain. First of all, I have played a bit of the game. Not a lot of it. A bit of it. Um, I don't really have much experience of it. <laughs> I've played in Season Spring and that's about it. And that's about it. <laughs> So you guys can give me useful tips or whatever in the comments and um, whatever can improve my farm life, that'll be helpful. So yeah. Oh, hello, you must be Hannah. <clears throat> I'm Robin the Lotkin Carpenter and Mayor Lewis sent me to fetch you and show you the way to your new home. He's right there now with how you face up for your arrival. Vaughn's right over here if you follow me. I already know who Robin is because of my other personal file. So This is the prismatic farm. I am so shocked by the mess all over my floor. What's the matter? Sure it's a bit overgrown, but there's no there's some good soil underneath that mess. With a little dedication you'll have it cleaned up in no time. Says you. I can't my foot while recording, so my foot's like kind of aching right now. And here we are, your new home. I look so out of it. Ah, the new farm. Welcome, I'm Lewis, Lewis, the mayor of Elegant Town. You know, everyone's been asking about you. It's not every day that someone new moves in. It's a, quite a big deal. So, you're moving into your grandfather's old cottage. It's good house, very rustic. Rustic, that's one way to put it. Christy might have a little more at that foot. Rude. Don't listen to her, Hannah. She's just trying to make you dissatisfied so you buy one of her house upgrades. Hmm. Anyway, you must be tired from the long journey. You should go and get some rest. Tomorrow you ought to explore the town a bit and new to choose to do. The new townspeople will appreciate that. Oh, I almost forgot. If you have anything to sell, just place it in the box here. I'll come by the joining the night to collect it. You mean you creepily look in my window and check if I'm surviving? Because... I don't think I'm going to survive. <laughs> Okay, let's get started. Um, so I put my timer on. We have 13 minutes left. So let's see what this says. Pass no seeds. You received 15 pass no seeds. Here's a little song to get you started. Me and Lewis. Okay, we have a TV. Ooh, what a report. Welcome to Cozy 5. It's going to be a beautiful sunny day tomorrow. Yippee! Watch and tell her. Welcome back to the workless oracle. If you seek a hidden knowledge of the future, you've come to the right place. The spirits have given you a good humor today. I think you'll have an extra look. Yay! Living off the land. Welcome to Living Off the Land. We're back at again with another tip for y'all. Now listen up. This one for all your greenhorns out there. Chop wood and search for wild forge to earn some cash while waiting on your new harvest. Okay, great. So we're gonna get. Why am I leaving like a sad sack? <laughs> First of all, we should clean this place up because it looks crap. <laughs> then we need to start. Um, oh, I need a scythe. Then we should start um, flatten down. Where we want everything. Okay. Chop that wood, chop that wood. Chop, 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 chop. Yay, timber. Oh my god. 
So we have some wood up to now. I think that's an this is another area for um for our planting. This is gonna get our hoe. Oh, oh wait, 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 I need to turn on something. This is so much easier when playing this game to turn that on. Because you know where you're going to hoe and when you're watering and everything. So, I recommend turning this on if you're going to play this game. Put down some seeds. We're going to keep the free bags. Okay, that's going to meet everyone since we've done that. For this video, I want to enter. Ooh, hi, squirrel. Oh, bye then. Oh, butterflies. Oh my god, it's happening. We have no room for anything. And you want to collect all this nice stuff that you can't. So on my personal file, I am dating, well not dating, trying to date, Sebastian. So I'm ruling him out, oh no, I'm ruling him out on this one. I've only got up to season, I'm only in season spring. I haven't done much in the game, don't really know much about it. So if you guys want to leave me some helpful comments and stuff, I'd be appreciated. Oh, 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 no, 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 damn it. <laughs> Hi! Ah, um, me, Lewis told you you had just arrived. I'm Maureen. Hi, Maureen. Who are you, sir? Sir? Hello? I'm getting some supplies for selling, and Pierre's got the good stuff. I'm getting to. Oh. The man, then. <laughs> hi, hi. Hey, it's Miss Hannah, the new farmer. I'm Perry, owner of the local general store. If you're looking for seeds, my shop is the place to go. I'll get buy reduce from you for a good price. Hello, Perry. Hello, other two characters. <laughs> okay. Oh, so we have Lewis's birthday on the 17th, 7th. We have Benson's birthday on the 10th. Then we have the Egg Festival on the 13th. 14th, we have Haley's birthday. 18th, we have Pam's. 20th, we have Shane's. 24th is the flower dance, 26th is Perry's birthday, and the 27th is Emily's birthday. Good to know. I love how this game is like pixelated and so cute. Hi. Hi. Oh, did you want something? No, I just wanted to talk for you being gloomy. But whatever. Who are you? And why do I have a feeling I don't? I'm not gonna like you. I know who you are now. Oh, you're the new farmer girl or whatever, aren't you? That's how she sounds in my head. Huh? Oh, I'm Haley. Hmm, huh. if it weren't for those horrendous clothes, you might be actually pretty. Actually, never mind. Says you, you pink headed doofus pancake head. I hate someone steps on your foot in the flower dance. <laughs> we have seven minutes left, wow. Okay. Hi, Sam. Sam. Hey, I'm Sam. Good to meet you. Oh, what's wrong, little buddy? Oh, stranger, my name's Vincent. Mama says not to talk to strangers, but you seem okay. Why are you upset? What are you doing? Oh, you aren't you exactly how I manage imagined you? Imagine, but that's okay. I'm Jody. Why? Is it because of my hair? Is it because I'm hit? I have pebble hair. That I'm not good enough to be a farmer. Is that it? I don't like you, Haley. Hello. It's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too, Leah. I feel like I've met loads of people right now. Oh God, Bunny just scared me. Like I said, um, because I know you can date in this game. I don't want to date Sebastian because he's on my personal file. 
and I just feel like that'll be boring if I go for the same people twice. So, hello there, welcome to Star Drew Valley Electional Offices. Oh, this is embarrassing. The previous career author made off of the entire collection. We have, don't really have anything to the artifacts with today. I'm hoping to remember that soon. If you find any artifacts or minerals out there, would you let me know? So basically, that's like the Animal Crossing um, museum. Let's go up here. I want to see the blacksmith. Hopefully he's in. Yes, he's in. Hi. Oh, uh, hi. I'm Clint. I'm the town blacksmith. If you need any any crochet two tools, I'm the guy. Thanks, Clint. Let's keep going. Um. Oh my God. I want to show you guys Sebastian. If you guys don't know who he is. Um, he's like an emo kind of <laughs> guy. Um, he's a programmer and he stays in his house all day. Oh, there's that. Uh oh, wait. I want to meet Granny. And what's her name? Well, hello and welcome to our little community. You can call me Granny if you like. Granny. Uh, Granny. 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 Oh my God, she just pushed me out. That pushed me out the house. Granny, move. <laughs> <laughs> Granny, I don't wanna... Hmm. It's irritating to meet all these new people, huh? New children, by the way, no buzz off, hmm? I wanted to meet Sam, and he's up there doing press-ups, or biceps, whatever. Him and Haley are meant to be. I'm just saying it now, they're meant to be. Oh! Here's Abigail. Don't like her. Oh, that's right, I heard someone new was moving into town, old town farm. It's kind of a shame, really. I always enjoy exploring the overgrown, overgrown fields by myself. Well, it's my field now. Find somewhere else. I'll punch you in the face. <laughs> I'm collecting these because I might need them. Okay, I want to see if Sebastian is going to be nice to me. Just run into a tree. Oh, aren't you the new one who's moved in? I'm Maru. I've been mean, looking forward to meet you. You know, with a small town like this, a new place can really also the community is dynamic. Dynamic. It's exciting. You can tell she's a small one. <laughs> okay. Um. So funny story. I was felt bad on the homeless guy. So I kept giving him food, and now we have one heart with each other. It's kind of funny. Greetings, I'm Dumaris, local scientist from Portland. How do you spend doing this to yourself? Hi, Robin. Have you met everyone in town? Yeah, that sounds exhausting. Not yet. I'm trying to meet your son, but he was in this prison of doom downstairs. He's my soulmate on my other so I'll, He's my soulmate on my other one. On my other thing. He's my soulmate. A what? What? No! 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 Ah! Ah! No! Uh oh, hi. <laughs> I look such like a creeper. He's probably thinking, what the hell? Who are you? What are you doing in my room? Uh, um, <laughs> out of the places she could live, you choose Pelican Town? Yeah, what's wrong with it? Bro, <laughs> he's judging me! Oh, he judged me! We'll be together soon, bae, on my other personal file. Don't you worry about that. <laughs> okay. I just look like the total creep of the town. Well done, Hannah. <laughs> Hi, sir. A stranger. Hello. Don't mind me, I just live out here alone. Right, he's the guy who I kept giving food to. Didn't realize we would gain a friendship. Like, see, we have me and on my other game, me and Sebastian have one heart, and then me and Linus have one heart. I felt bad for him, okay? He was like getting bullied by people. Like, they were throwing stones at his house. Like, I couldn't just 
sit there and not help the poor guy out. Oh my god, a personal save. I couldn't do that. I felt mean. <laughs> I felt bad for him, okay? Don't judge me. So besides, 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 Sebastian, Sebastian, <laughs> I need help picking another guy to date. Hey, you're the new girl, huh? I think we're gonna get along great. I'm Alex. I'll see you around. No, you won't. Hey, kid, the name's Pam. Don't be a jerk, and we'll get along fine. Um. Okay. Hey, stop that yuck! <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm broke. Hi! Can we go in there? Oh, we can't. Never knew that. Give me the usual. Hi, Gus. Hi there, Hannah. I'm glad to see you're always welcome here. Even though I can't drink. <laughs> Oh, I can read it on your face. You're going to love it in Pelican Town. If you're ever looking for something to do evening, stop by the saloon. That's where I work. Yes, of course I can see you're judging me for being behind the bar when I'm underage. Don't worry. What the hell is that? Ooh, that was my time. <laughs> and that scared me. Ooh, how do I take it? We'll save that in case we need it. Ooh, look at the bear. I'm gonna play a bit more because I feel like I haven't posted really any videos. Hi! I don't know you. Why are you talking to me? I'm trying to be flippin' friendly. Doctor, no, he went inside. Uh, it's locked. Damn it! <laughs> uh. Okay. I've met half of you on town, so far. I've got to meet Elliot. And I know he's on the beach. Because I played on my personal file. He kept, wouldn't talk to me for like, on my personal file, he wouldn't talk to me at all. He kept going in his beach house. And made me upset because he kept going in his stupid beach house and I couldn't get to talk to him and I don't know where he's gone now. Boo! <laughs> this is Mayor Lewis' house. I just felt like doing that. But everyone's going to the saloon now. So I could catch everyone here. Hopefully. Need a hot meal? No. I need everyone to come in here so I can greet them. Excuse me. Okay, while we're here, on my Twitter. On my Twitter, Average Sim, who tweeted me, thank you for telling me some tips and tricks for this game. I am still a noob. <laughs> I only know some things and not a lot, basically. So if you have any tips and tricks, leave them in the comments down below or tweet me at a prismatic Simmer. But first of all, she said on my Twitter, Best game ever. Take food with you to the mines, watch the TV for the weather report, build the solo early. So I'm guessing that's for like animals and stuff. Whoa! What's the pickaxe? Axe thing there. Oh, I have a road to talk to him, I guess so. So I guess I'm just gonna end now. Because no one's going out. And I need to upload this quickly. So let's run home. So we've met half of the town. I've got pins and needles on my foot. It's gonna be annoying. Anyway, we've met half the town. Let's see. We've met Shane, Penny, George, Evelyn, Haley, Jody, <laughs> Vincent, Sam, Perry, Abigail, Gus, Emily, Pam, Clint, Sebastian, Demetrius, Robin, Maru. Linus, Maney, Leah, Alex, Lewis. Need to meet, need to meet, need to meet, need to meet. So we only have a few to meet. Um, that's okay. We met half of the town anyway. Um, tell me who you think I should date. Um, we're ruling out Sebastian because I'm dating him on my personal save. 
well we have about a heart there and nearly a heart there so I don't want to feel like I have to date them on both my saves because that's kind of annoying so you guys can pick oh I want a fire you guys can pick who we should date um, let me know in the comments. I hope you enjoyed the first part. If you did, give me a big thumbs up and like and share with your friends. It helps me out a lot. And I hope to see you again on the second part of Stardew Valley. Bye. Hey,